Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing well and staying cozy wherever you are. Just as we were enjoying the last golden days of autumn, with colorful leaves crunching underfoot and mild breezes, winter is arriving early this year, catching many of us by surprise. A powerful blast of Arctic air is heading straight for Europe, bringing a real shock to the system. This isn't your typical seasonal change, it's a dramatic shift that will be felt across the continent. This isn't just a slight chill, temperatures are set to plummet rapidly, and the first significant snowfall of the season is on the way for many regions. Streets that were just covered in leaves could soon be blanketed in snow. This is what meteorologists call an Arctic outbreak, a mass of freezing air from the North Pole sweeping south, pushing aside the last remnants of autumn warmth. Imagine opening a giant freezer door and letting all the cold air rush out. That's what's about to happen across the continent. The cold will be sudden and intense, catching many off guard. So, what does this mean for you? It's time to get ready for a rapid shift from mild autumn to harsh winter in just a couple of days. You'll want to dig out your warmest coats, scarves, and gloves, and maybe even check your boots for snow readiness. This weather will impact everything from your daily commute to your home heating. Roads could become slippery, and you might need to adjust your morning routine to allow extra time for travel. But don't worry, being prepared is key. A little planning now can make a big difference in how you handle the cold snap. Over the next few minutes, I'll explain the science behind this event, breaking down why it's happening and what you can expect. I'll show you where and when the cold will hit hardest so you can plan ahead and avoid any surprises. And I'll share practical tips to keep you safe and warm, from dressing in layers to making your home winter ready. Let's get winter ready together and make sure no one is caught off guard. With a little preparation, and by looking out for each other we can handle whatever this arctic blast throws at us. Remember, winter is easier when we face it as a community, so let's dive in and make sure we're all set for the big chill next week. Stay tuned, stay warm, and let's tackle this early winter together. Why is this happening now? What's behind this sudden and intense chill sweeping across Europe, catching so many off guard? The answer lies high above us, in the upper layers of our atmosphere, with a powerful force known as the jet stream. Normally, the jet stream acts like a giant, invisible fence, separating the icy Arctic air to the north from the milder, more temperate air to the south. It helps keep our weather patterns stable and predictable, but right now, something unusual is happening. The jet stream has developed a dramatic kink over the Atlantic Ocean, creating a direct pathway for frigid Arctic air to surge down over Europe, bringing an early taste of winter. Adding to this, a stubborn area of high pressure near Greenland is acting like a doorstop, holding the gateway open for this cold air and blocking any attempts by milder weather to return. This particular setup is infamous among meteorologists for triggering long-lasting cold spells across the continent, sometimes lasting weeks. There's also another player in the mix, a phenomenon called sudden stratospheric warming. This event can disrupt the polar vortex, a swirling mass of cold air over the Arctic, and weaken the jet stream even further, making these Arctic outbreaks much more likely and severe. It's a complex chain reaction, involving multiple layers of the atmosphere and several weather systems interacting at once. But the end result is clear. A significant and widespread freeze is on its way, and it could last longer than many expect. The combination of these rare factors means we're about to experience a dramatic and far-reaching drop in temperatures, affecting millions across Europe. So, get ready to bundle up and brace yourself for a true taste of winter, arriving much earlier than usual this year. Next, let's take a closer look at when and where this intense cold will strike, and how you can prepare for what's coming. The cold arrives Monday, first hitting the UK and Ireland with a sharp biting wind. Temperatures will fall quickly. By Monday evening, the chill will be undeniable. By Tuesday and Wednesday, the heart of the Arctic air will settle over Western Europe, bringing the lowest temperatures of the week. The UK, Ireland, France and the Benelux countries will be firmly in the grip of the freeze, with daytime highs barely above freezing and nights well below zero. Frost and ice will make travel tricky, and the cold will linger for several days. By Thursday and Friday the chill spreads into Germany, Poland, Spain, and Portugal, even reaching the northern coast of Africa. This cold spell is expected to last most of the week with blocking high pressure keeping the freeze in place. Prepare for a sustained period of winter weather, not just a brief cold snap. Now let's talk about the kind of weather this Arctic blast will bring. 
This Arctic blast isn't just about cold, it's bringing snow, wind, and rain. Expect significant snowfall in the mountains of Scotland, the Pennines, and the Alps, with travel disruption likely. Sea effect snow could hit coastal areas of northern Scotland, eastern England, the Netherlands, and Germany, even at low levels. These snow showers can be intense, causing sudden poor visibility on roads. The wind chill will make it feel much colder than the thermometer shows, minus 5 to minus 10 degrees Celsius in some places. Dress properly to avoid hypothermia and frostbite. Meanwhile, as cold air meets warmer Mediterranean air, expect heavy rain and thunderstorms in Italy, the Balkans and Greece, with a risk of local flooding. So, while much of Europe braces for snow and ice, the south faces heavy downpours and strong winds. One Arctic blast, two very different weather stories. Let's see how this will play out across Europe. The UK and Ireland will feel the chill first, as a wave of Arctic air sweeps in, sending daytime highs tumbling to just 2 to 4 degrees Celsius. Overnight, hard frosts will grip the region, turning streets and gardens into icy landscapes. People will wake up to frozen windshields and see their breath hanging in the air as they head out in the morning. France and the Benelux countries are next in line, bracing for intense cold starting Tuesday. The wintry blast will bring a sharp drop in temperatures, making even short walks outside feel biting. In Paris, the mercury will struggle to rise above freezing, with thermometers dipping well below zero at night. The city's iconic landmarks will be dusted with frost, creating a picturesque but frigid scene. Snow is possible even in lowland areas, blanketing towns and countryside alike, and making travel more difficult for commuters and families. In the Netherlands, residents should prepare for icy canals and cold bike rides as the chill transforms familiar cityscapes into winter wonderlands. Cyclists will need to bundle up and watch for slippery paths. As the cold front pushes further south, Spain and Portugal will experience a dramatic temperature drop, with cities like Madrid and Lisbon waking up to frosty mornings and unusually cold days. Madrid in particular will see several nights below freezing, forcing residents to dig out their warmest coats and scarves. The city's usually mild winter will feel much harsher than normal. Heavy snowfall in the Pyrenees and Cantabrian mountains could disrupt transport between Spain and France, with mountain passes becoming treacherous and some roads possibly closed due to snowdrifts. Even North Africa will notice the chill, as unusually low temperatures sweep across Morocco and Algeria, surprising locals who are more accustomed to milder winters. A dusting of snow is possible in the Atlas Mountains, creating rare and beautiful winter scenes in a region that seldom sees such weather. This Arctic outbreak is both powerful and far-reaching, stretching from the northernmost parts of Scotland all the way to the mountains of North Africa. Millions of people, from the snowy Scottish Highlands to the bustling streets of Morocco, will be affected by this dramatic shift in weather. Almost everyone in Western Europe will feel its effects next week, as cities brace for colder days, icy roads, and the need for extra layers. Now, let's talk about how this cold snap will impact our daily lives. Preparation is key, so make sure to stay warm, check on neighbors, and get ready for a true taste of winter across the continent. Severe cold weather impacts more than just the temperature. It affects our daily routines, travel will be hazardous, Expect icy roads, black ice, and delays on trains and flights. Allow extra time for journeys and check travel updates before leaving home. Our energy systems will be under pressure as heating demand surges, sometimes leading to local power outages. Vulnerable groups, elderly, young children, and those with health conditions, are at greater risk, so check in on neighbors and relatives. Homeless charities will be working hard to provide shelter during this dangerous cold. Agriculture will also feel the impact, with hard frosts threatening late crops and gardens. Farmers and gardeners should take steps to protect plants and produce. This early freeze is a real challenge for everyone from commuters to those working the land. Community spirit and preparation will help us get through. Next, let's run through your winter checklist. A few simple steps can make a big difference. Preparation is everything. Start by checking your heating system and insulating pipes to prevent freezing. Block drafts around windows and doors to keep heat in. Dress in layers. Hats, gloves, scarves, and insulated footwear are essential. Keep warm blankets and a hot water bottle handy for chilly evenings. Prepare a small emergency kit torch, batteries, power bank, non-perishable food, bottled water, and enough medication for a week. In your car, add a blanket, shovel, de-icer, and ice scraper. Stay informed. 
Check weather forecasts regularly for updates and warnings. A few minutes of planning now can save you trouble later. Talk to your family about your plans, especially if you have children or elderly relatives. Make sure everyone knows how to stay safe and warm. With these steps, you'll be ready for whatever winter brings. Now, let's learn from Europe's past big freezes. Europe has faced sudden, severe cold spells before, and there's a lot we can learn. The winter of 2010 brought months of snow and record lows, causing travel chaos and highlighting the need for preparation. The beast from the east in 2018, driven by a sudden stratospheric warming event, brought blizzards and deep cold, even to places like London and Ireland. These events showed the dangers of wind chill and sea effect snow, but also the resilience and community spirit of people. Neighbors helped each other, volunteers supported essential workers, and communities set up shelters. The key lessons, take warnings seriously, prepare in advance, and look out for your community. A simple act of kindness, like checking on a neighbor, can make a world of difference. By learning from the past, we can face this cold snap with confidence. Preparation and community are our best defenses. Let's wrap up with a final thought. A major Arctic blast is on its way, bringing an early start to winter. We've covered the science, the timeline, and the impacts on travel, homes, and daily life. The main message, be prepared and stay positive. Use this weekend to check your heating, gather winter essentials, and talk to your family about staying safe. Community spirit matters. Reach out to neighbors, especially those who might need extra help. Small acts of kindness can make a big difference during tough times. Winter can be beautiful, too. Enjoy the first frost, fresh snow, and cozy evenings indoors. This cold snap will pass, and with preparation and care, we'll get through it together. Stay warm, stay safe, and keep an eye on the latest updates. I'll be here every morning with the latest news. Let's face this Arctic blast as a community. We've got this.